between 70 and 200,000 people dead, more than 250,000 injured, 1.5 million homeless. On this day, the 18th of January 2010, this is the sad toll of the devastating earthquake in Haiti. The European Commission, through its humanitarian aid department, has acted quickly by allocating a budget of 30 million euros to its humanitarian partners deployed in the field. Each organization is using its knowledge and experience to respond to the devastation caused by the earthquake. Here is an account by Médecin du Monde. They're all like that. They've stayed days and days, some with limbs completely lost, alive with makeshift bandages and waiting for surgery. It's a fact. We can't operate them all at the same time. We have to do it one at a time. And that isn't quick. The five other organizations financed by the European Commission are the World Food Programme, the Finnish and German Red Cross, Oxfam UK and Telecom Sans Frontières. Many of ECHO's humanitarian partners already working in Haiti before the earthquake have lost members of their staff. In addition, most of their installations have been damaged or destroyed. Despite these problems, aid is getting through. Imagine yourself, you, you lost everything. And moreover, you can't, you can't even say to your family that you're alive. So basically, that's, that's why it's so important for those people. They, they just come here, they, their first message is to say, I'm alive, I'm okay, don't worry. Well, the house is down. Then they start, they start the bad news, because of course there's always bad news. It's very emotional moments, and sometimes they cry, they shout. They, when they come to say, dad is dead, um, our brother didn't make it, it's a very emotive moment. So I think it's important because for them they, they face the trauma and the fact that they can speak to, to a loved one and it's like I, I would compare to like a psychological support, speaking and it's releasing a, a weight they, they have with them. That's why I think it's a very important service. They asked news of all my family. I said that all the family is fine, no problem. All our things are ruined, that's the way it is. Thank God we're alive and we're here. Life continues for us. Life continues. <laughs> 